What's up you guys? How you doing? Well, I hope. So excited to bring you this haul today. It's gonna have you shook. So today I'm partnering with ThreadUp again. If you don't know, ThreadUp is an online thrift store. So basically you can shop secondhand, reduce that carbon footprint. This is my third video with them. You guys are loving them. So I'm happy to keep doing them for you. Happy to keep doing them for me. <laughs> um, got some bomb items, got six pieces of time. They're so good, so good, including this sweater dress that I'm wearing. I'm so feeling these black and blue stripes right now. They're so, so good. So I'm gonna show you this dress. I'm gonna show you some other things that I got. And this time I'm gonna style them for you. So instead of just showing you what I bought, I'm gonna show you how you can make thrifted items look fly and expensive. Look like a million bucks, why don't ya? First up, pair of pants. I don't think I've gotten pants from the site before. These menswear inspired trousers are amazing. Now you may say, Kelly, you know, these look like kind of like work pants or something like that. And I don't really do traditional work wear because my job is hyper creative and I can get away with a lot of different types of pieces. So whether you have a corporate job and this type of pant is going to be great for you and you pair it with like a white button down and a great cardigan or a suit jacket, um, I'm going to style it in kind of a fun Kelly sort of way. Um, I think that with this look, it's really all about trends. So menswear is a huge trend, you know, graphic tees are a big trend. And so what I'm doing is I'm pairing this with one of my favorite graphic t-shirts that I think is so, so cute. I'm layering a sheer top underneath because I do want this like peekaboo of pink underneath. I think it just adds something to the look and I think it makes it much more interesting. Also gonna put on my Vans because I love the play of the black and white in the Vans and the black and white in the trousers. And I think it's also really cool to wear trousers with sneakers. It's very like Euro, very um, kind of like London street style, which I think is also very popular here. I personally would wear this look just about anywhere. Um, I could get aware with, away with wearing this look to a meeting. I might wear it to hang out because it's super comfortable. Just any given day. This is kind of like an everyday perfect look for me. I'm wearing pants, I'm wearing sneakers, I'm comfortable, but I'm dressed up. And I think it's really just about layers with this look. One of the easiest ways to kind of look expensive is to layer and to layer well. Um, you wanna be thoughtful about kind of like what you're putting with what, you wanna get a little bit creative, flex your creative style, all those things lend to a much more posh appearance. Next up, knits. It is a ribbed, cozy, beautiful turtleneck. Now for me, a turtleneck on its own already gives you luxury. Turtlenecks are the jam. I think they look so, so expensive. And I love how soft this thing is. This one's from Coldwater Creek. It has the tag on it, never been worn. Love that. Um, the pants, if I didn't mention, were from Lane Bryant, but this is from Coldwater Creek. And this thing is so, like, I'm so excited about this. I'll be pairing this with another piece that I got from ThreadUp, which you will see um, the full outfit of like how I made it look expensive, but on its own, cozy knits that are well constructed. This thing is so soft and cozy. It just looks so, so luxe. And as you can see, the price tag isn't crazy. I think the original price was like $35. Winning. Next item I'm gonna show you is this baby. It is this charcoal gray corduroy mini skirt you can see it's pretty short um but long enough don't worry i'm not you know having my buns out uh this is from old navy and i was kind of on the fence about this i saw it and i was like something's drawing me to it but i'm not sure so i kind of put my thinking cap on and then this this texture of the corduroy paired with the texture of the turtleneck that ribbed turtleneck i thought would be so so cute together here's the trick I think that one, mixing textures is fantastic. Also a great way to look luxe. So number one, textures. Number two, proportions. I think that playing with proportions in your outfit can make you look super luxe and make your outfit look very thoughtful. I live for a mini skirt with a long jacket. I think it's so sexy. I think it's so cool. I think it's so fashion forward. So I'm pairing this corduroy mini skirt with the rib sweater and I'm adding my camel coat. 
because nothing screams luxury like a camel coat. So if you wanna look expensive, grab the a camel coat. Boom. Next up, you guys. This is so pretty. Are you dying? This velvety velour, whatever you wanna call it, skirt with this dark floral print is bringing me life. Not giving me life, it's bringing me to life then giving me life, sustenance, and such, okay? This skirt is amazing. It is from Worthington, and it is just perfection. It doesn't have a tag on it, but it looks like someone never touched this thing. I don't know why not. They're bugging. They gave it away. You're bad. It's mine now. <laughs> it's amazing so when you have something that is in this like velvety velour texture it's already going to look super luxe because it's just so cozy and opulent looking it looks so good but i quickly mentioned textures pairing this two ways um so i'm going to show you this look for in two ways the first is with my favorite it's a sequin top. I call it a sequin sweatshirt, to be honest, because it's just this oversized sequin top with raw edges that looks amazing with most things. I think the texture of the sequins, the texture of the velvet, the print of the, you know, skirt paired with this like color of this top is so gorgeous. It's like a perfect, comfy, cool holiday kind of look. Very fall, very holiday vibes. Obsessed. The second way I'm going to show it to you is mixing in a lace crop top, which I'm shook by. This was actually part of a dress that I kind of took out because I like wearing the dress on its own. So this lace crop top and then throwing over my satiny gold trench coat. It just is like regal and luxe and it just makes me makes me all warm inside you guys it just makes me all warm inside so good the next thing i'm going to show you is this it's amazing it's an army green coat it's from the avenue and it actually has the tags on i cannot believe i found this and i cannot believe the price this army green itself looks so incredibly luxe. This is one of those, you pair it with anything. I'm gonna throw on like some easy pants, some an easy sweater, and just work it like this. I think that when you put the perfect topper on any outfit, it automatically elevates it. You automatically look like you're pulled together, you look much more luxe, and I'm in love. I'm in love. It's the perfect color. It has this like military influence, kind of olive green. It's structured, it's cool. I'm into it. The last thing I'm gonna show you is this dress that I'm wearing, these blue stripes. It's a sweater dress, which sweater dresses aren't my jam, but maybe they should be. Perfect world, I'd have on some thigh high boots, either black or glittery or something. Um, and then of course, just put my favorite duster over top because I like my bodycon dresses topped with something. That's my personal choice, not mandatory. But yeah, it's just cozy and cute and looks sexy and fun. And I think that, you know, the dress alone is dead cute. But just adding a little bit, adding another layer, I think does kind of up the ante, makes it even more stylish and more luxe and more expensive looking. So if you have not tried Thrup, there is a code here with a huge discount. I hope you take advantage. You guys have been loving it. Um, excited to share that with you. Excited to share my pieces and excited to show you some outfits because I'm gonna be wearing these all week long, basically. I feel like I'm kind of set for the week. Um, so yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Love you, made it. Bye.